Welcome to Heavy Metal Monday. Hey, it's Mike Capilion coming here live from Varsity House Gym. Welcome back to another edition of Heavy Metal Monday. Okay guys, so today I'm going to bring you a challenge that I have in the gym today. It's going to be a grip challenge. Um, what you're going to see me do is an implement that we call the PVC pipe. Okay, uh, The PVC pipe, we have water in it and we have two different ones, PVC pipes. We have a small one and then we have a really big one. I'm going to do both of them. I'm going to, have, I'm going to do the small one first just to kind of show you what I'm going to be doing and then I'm going to do the big one. Um, so my challenge to anyone who comes to Varsity House Gym or uh, if you have these uh, what we call slosh pipes, the implement that we're using here is called a slosh pipe. Uh, if you have a slosh pipe in your own gym or in your facility, um, this could be like a little challenge you could do for yourself <clears throat> or with your athletes. So what the challenge is, is you're going to see me, I'm going to double hand, overhand grip the uh, slosh pipe. The first one I do, you'll see is smaller, and the second one that I do is much bigger. Um, so kind of two challenges here. The first challenge is one, just to be able to double overhand grip it, kind of like a clean up to your shoulders. And the second challenge would be, if that's easy, try to do 10 unbroken. Okay, meaning when you finish it, bring it right back down to the ground without letting go and do another one in a row. So try to do 10 like that. It's very difficult. Um, I've done it a few times. Your forearms are burning, fingers and thumbs are burning. But it's something fun. So anybody who's coming to Varsity House Gym watching this um, video today, uh, if you're coming into the gym this week, give that a shot. That's my challenge to you. Try to come in and try to double overhand the big slosh pipe for, uh, for, uh, for pride and glory. So it's a pretty cool, uh, pretty cool grip thing. I do this a lot with my college guys or some of my, my other clients, my high school kids and stuff like that for some fun. I'll just line it up on the ground and we'll see who the, the only guy who can come over and try to grab it and kids go fun with it and it's, it's pretty cool. So, um, and then try that and then make sure you stay tuned at the end of my show for my heavy metal album of the week. Let's do it. Okay guys, so there you go, that, that's um, the PVC pipe challenge, the slosh pipe challenge with the grip. Uh, I did the small one in the beginning and then I did the uh, bigger one there uh, right after that. Um, I know in the video I looked a little banged up, I just finished uh, training and it was pretty pretty hot today. That New Jersey weather was pretty brutal today, so um, yeah, I kind of looked a little out of it. But uh, that was it, I was able, uh, it's, it's, it's once you, you got to make sure, the most important thing is if you're teaching your kid or to do it is to make sure that they line up evenly because the way you make a uh, PVC pipe, flash pipe, is you take basically a PVC pipe, you cap the sides, and before you cap it, put a little water in it, and then you cap the sides, super glue the sides, and that's it. It's very, it's really cheap. You can go to Home Depot and get one. It's a really cool thing. We use the slosh pipes a lot here for stability holds, overhead stability holds. We'll do it with carries. It's great to do with some young, the small ones with the young guys for some stability work carrying with the female athletes. So we use them a lot here, and that's just a fun drill there. So that's my grip challenge for you guys this week. Uh, try to double overhand that slosh pipe, the big one, or the biggest one that you have. Maybe try to go unbroken with it without, um, see how long you can go without dropping it without putting it to the ground, keeping the grip, bringing it back to the shoulders, bringing it down, see how, see how many reps you could do. So pretty cool challenge, and uh, it's a lot of fun. You'll, you'll, uh, you'll, you'll like it what you do with your clients and stuff, they'll enjoy it. Okay guys, so uh, we're gonna move on to my heavy metal album of the week, and uh, today, we're gonna talk about the band Hatebreed. Uh, Hatebreed's been a band I've talked a lot about here. Uh, I've mentioned it before, unfortunately, I've not been able to go see them, but they're on tour right now. Uh, I'm looking to try to go. They're on tour with Devil Driver, another one of my uh, favorite metal bands, and they came out with a new album called The Concrete Confessional. But the album we're going to do today, the album of the week, is going to be the album Perseverance. Uh, this album was done by Hatebreed in 2002, which is unbelievable. It's 14 years ago, um, which is right around the time I really started listening to them. When I got into high school, I graduated in 05. I got into high school in 2001. That's when I really started getting into Hatebreed. I've been listening to them ever since. So about 15 years of listening to Hatebreed. They're one of my favorite uh, hardcore metal bands. We talked about their genre. Um, you know, they're not thrash. They're a little bit more on that hardcore type, uh, like, like throw 
throw down or sworn enemy and stuff like that. And uh, but I think they they kill it. I really really uh, am looking forward. Hopefully one day to go see them. So uh, the album of the week is Perseverance. It's got all some of my favorite songs that they've ever done. Uh, Proven the song Perseverance. Um, just a, a fantastic heavy metal hardcore album. So if you get an opportunity, you get a chance, check out that album, Perseverance by Hatebreed. Guys, give that challenge a shot, that grip challenge of the week. Uh, make sure if you have any questions for me, get them to, to me as soon as you can. Make sure you check us out here at varsityhousegym.com. I'll see you guys all next week. And until then, stay heavy.